Okay, one of the things I've always found challenging in the past is keeping track of student tardies in a course and then enforcing um, high school policy. So I just wanted to bring up this screen to show you what that policy is and then show you in Infinite Campus a very easy way to check, check, uh, track this on a regular basis. So you can see here that uh, if a student has received between one and three tardies, the teacher is supposed to warn the student and contact home on the third tardy. Um, Tardies four through seven, the teacher contacts home and completes a referral to the assistant principal for a one hour detention. Uh, tardy eight results in an in school intervention center assignment, and tardy nine is a parent conference with conference with assistant principal. Uh, and so these are the tardies that a teacher uh, needs to kind of keep track of and then uh, follow the appropriate action that's that's listed on this page. So let's show you now how in Infinite Campus uh, we can very easily track their uh, tardies and then follow the policy. So in Infinite Campus, the way we would put together this report uh, on a daily basis is to go over here to where it says instruction and then move on down here under reports and we're looking for attendance summary report once we get onto this page uh, we have the option here to say which term and that was kind of always the challenge at least from my perspective with Tyler SIS was keeping track of the tardies per term because it didn't it didn't reflect it that way uh, in uh, the teacher view so in infinite campus we can choose the grading period that we're keeping track of the tardies because our tardy counts do reset each uh, grading period per school policy uh, so once we get into a new grading period we start the count over again as far as any kind of disciplinary reaction or intervention so we can say which grading period we want and then we can choose the course. Yes, you can choose, you can go between any one of your courses. You could check all five or six of your courses here on the same screen. So I'm just going to take a look at my first period, Chemistry B. And then down here along the bottom, there's a spot that says Generate PDF. A box will pop up on the screen that will give you an entire uh, count. Um, at the end of this video, I'll actually post this screenshot so you can see it just in case it's not reflected here. But it will show you your entire roster for that period. But what this report shows you is the term. It's got the student name. It's got the grade they're in. And then it counts by absent excused, absent unknown, absent unexcused, absent exempt, total absent, and tardy. From there we can now get an accurate count as to how many tardies have taken place in any one grading period and then much more easily uh, follow the rules that are in place in the principal's handbook. That's all there is to running a custom attendance count report.